Amen. God bless you again. This is Bishop Stevens from Atlanta, Georgia. I thank you right now for just being here. I come to just bless the Lord at this time. I pray that someone that is listening to, you, listening to me on this evening, that they will get blessed. Good God Almighty. I feel the spirit right now. I thank God because God has been good. Even though right now, I thank God even with my ups and my downs. Oh, hallelujah. Even what I'm going through, my God is able to do all things. Let me tell you something on this evening. I know somebody right now is not knowing which way they're going to turn, but they don't know what's going to happen. They're going through a trial that the devil is telling them that they, it ain't going to work. But I stopped by on this evening to let you know that the God that I serve, he's able. Oh, well, I'm getting happy. Let me, no, no, I don't want to get carried away. First one, well, let me say a prayer right now. Let us bow our heads. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, my God, I thank you, Jesus, right now for blessing us, God, this day, this moment, this time. God, I pray that whatever I say on this moment, this day, this period of time, that Lord, somebody shall be touch in the name of Jesus. God, right now, God, as I open my mouth, God, begin to speak the words of God. Lord, open up me up, God. Open me up. God, open me up. That Lord, somebody be touched in the name of Jesus. Let us say amen. Father, right now, I thank you. I thank you. I know somebody is listening tonight on this evening and somebody is going through, but I just want to say right now, you're going to make it. If you can take a look at then you shall take a ticket. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah. God is a blessed God. God is a omnipotent God. God is a real God. Oh, hallelujah. My God is able to do all things. All you got to do is trust God, believe in God, and he shall. He will work it out. Oh, I just want to read before I get carried away. I want to read just a little bit. You'll find me over in Romans, hallelujah. Starting at the eighth chapter looking just at the 28th verse and it read it it says and we know that all things work together for the good to them that love God the word says all things it didn't say some things but the word of God says all things work together for the good of those who love God my God. Oh, come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. I know you hear me right now. I know you hear me right now. Oh, hallelujah. And then it says, to, who, to those who are called to his purpose. Oh, I would like to do on this evening. I would just love to talk to you a little bit. My subject on this evening is God is working it out for you. Can I say that one more time? The Lord God is working it out for you. Oh, oh, there's nothing too hard for God can do. Oh, hallelujah. Somebody right now is getting ready to face a judge. Somebody right now, somebody right now is going to the hospital. Don't know what's going to happen when they get there, but I come to tell you, I come to tell you that God, he'll meet you there. Oh, hallelujah. He's never too late. He's always on time. He's on time, God. There is nothing too hard for God to do. Oh, let me slow it down a little bit. Let me slow it down. Let me, let me slow it down a little bit. Let me tell you something. It's really in the word of God. David, he, he, David, David, my brother David, in, in, in Psalm 23 says, For the Lord is my shepherd. Oh, hallelujah. And I shall not want. Because David know that anything he asked God for, the Lord worked it out for him. Let me tell you all something. I don't care what you're going through. I, 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 I don't care what you're going through. I don't care how hard it gets. God is able to work it out. Oh, hallelujah. Somebody right now said, well, the economy is stopping me. No, the economy is not stopping you. You stopping yourself because I don't care what we go through. The Lord will work it out. Oh, can I get a witness? How can I get a witness? Can I get a witness? Let me tell y'all something. I thank God for working it out. He's not only working out for me, but he's working it out for you. The Lord is working it out. Stop worrying. Stop worrying. Stop worrying. Trust God. He shall. He will. He will work it out for you. Oh, hallelujah. I thank God. I thank God. A long time ago, I had to find God for myself. And oftentimes I think about as I, I walk this Christian journey, how many times I put myself 
in harm's way. How many times did I put myself in a way that I caught? Sometimes I said, it was the devil. No, it wasn't. It was me. Let me tell you something. If you don't wait on God and let God fix it for you and you take it upon yourself, well, let me tell you something. The word of God said you shall reap what you sow. God is working it out. He's working it out. He's working it out. He's working it out. Oh, I feel good right now because I know whatever I go through, he will bring me through. If I only trust God, my subject again, the Lord is working it out. You don't have to worry. Stop crying. Stop worrying. Oh, hallelujah. Stop that, thinking that the devil is going to get the best. No, he ain't. If you trust God, he's working it out. He's working it out. He's working it out. God is the best judge. God is the best lawyer. God is the best doctor. Come on, somebody. How you know that God is? Because he brought me a mighty, mighty, mighty long way. I thank God. Hallelujah. I have a testimony that one day, hallelujah, I got hurt on my job. Hallelujah. My leg, I tore my ACL. My lateral meniscus flipped. But I thank God for three years, my leg was locked at a 90 degree. But glory, ha, ha, glory, y'all don't hear me. I said, Kakao, glory be to God. My leg right now, I still have it. Even though the doctors wanted to cut it off. The doctors wanted to cut my leg off from here down. Oh, come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. But I began to trust God. I began again to call on him. I began to look up. Hallelujah. Like Moses. When Moses got to the Red Sea, Moses couldn't go back. He couldn't go forward. But God spoke to him. Moses said, Moses, stretch out the rod. And when Moses stretched out his rod, Hallelujah. God made a way out of nowhere. Huh? God departed the Red Sea. Huh? Let me tell you something. Huh? God's parting the Red Sea in your life. Huh? He's parting your troubles. Come on. He's letting you walk through. Hallelujah. All you got to do is trust God. He's real. He's real. He's real. He's real. He's able to do all things but fail. Huh? But fail. Huh? But fail. Somebody right now saying, what's the use of calling on God? Oh, hallelujah. I can't see my way out. But I called and come to let you know right now, you ain't got no minute trying to see your way out. Especially with the natural. You better be looking in the spiritual. Because that's the answer. He'll make a way out of no way. If you trust God. Trust him. Let me tell y'all something. I walked around for three for two years and I have with a, a feeding tube, a bag across my along my stomach, but I did not allow that to stop me from serving God. Because I know the God I serve. He's gonna bring me through. He's gonna bring me through. He's gonna bring me through. He's gonna bring me out. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I thank God for this day. I thank God for this moment right now. Because if it wasn't for the Lord being on my side, I wouldn't be here today. I wouldn't have this testimony today. I wouldn't be here right now. Let me tell you something. I thank God. Because if it wasn't for the Lord saving my soul, I probably would either be dead today or I would have been in jail. Because I was running loose like a mean, cow, a mean bulldog. But I thank God. He calmed me down. I'm a better man. I'm a, I'm a good husband. I'm a better father. Come on, somebody. You can't do it if you don't have God in your life. You need God. Trying to make it. We're trying to make it without God. It ain't going to work. It ain't going to work, my brother and my sister. It's not going to work. You need him. You need him. You need him today. You need him tomorrow. You need God. As I say again. He's working it out. He's working it out. He's working it out, my brother. He's working it out, my sister. All you got to do is trust the Lord. He shall and he will bring you out. Let me tell y'all something. Let me see. I, I, I listen to the news. Seeing how people are losing their homes. People are losing their jobs. Oh, hallelujah. Folks are losing their mind. Good God Almighty. Hallelujah. Instead of them trusting in God and waiting on God, they'll take a gun and take their life. But I come to tell you something. That ain't the answer. That ain't the way. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Oh, you got to trust him if you want a way out. Trust God. He's the way out. He's the lily in the valley. He's the bright and morning star. He's the one when I'm up, he'll pick me up. He's the one when I'm down, he'll bring me out. Come on, somebody. All you got to do is trust in him. He's a mighty God.